Greetings everyone. This week's video is going to be a little different. Um, we're just going to show one technique and I like to call it the scapular lift. It's a real good technique to work the rhomboids, the subscapularis and stretch those muscles out. So here we go with the subscapular lift technique video. So now after we did the erector spine A we will move up and work the rhomboids here using some fingertip friction. I'm actually using my thumbs and I'm just lightly pulling towards me using friction. Now this little thumb stroke here we're working on the rhomboid minor and the rhomboid major and if you notice my entire arm is moving I'm not using the small muscles of my thumb to do this stroke. As I push down my thumb just kind of kicks out so I'm not really using the muscles of my thumb to do this stroke. I'm actually just applying pressure and moving my arm. Using my entire body, I'm not just going to be using my deltoids and you know my upper body muscles. So now we'll step to the corner of the table and we'll work the muscles of the posterior aspect of the scapula, the infraspinatus and supraspinatus. So here we're working the infraspinatus and just above that is the supraspinatus. Now a little effleurage stroke, once again warming up those rhomboids for this scapular lift. There are many ways to do this. This is the one I prefer uh, because I can do it on all my clients. So I'm going to put my hand underneath and I'm going to kind of cut in with my hands. Now make sure your nails are properly trimmed. You can easily scratch someone if they are not. So using the edge of my hand, trying to work underneath the scapula, working the muscular tendinous junctions of the rhomboid major and minor. And if I'm lucky I can get underneath there further and work the subscapularis muscle. Just doing a little bit of friction as I apply pressure as I'm also lifting up on the shoulder. Once again, if your client has had any previous shoulder injury uh, or current shoulder injury, you do not want to do this technique. It could cause more damage. And now we'll just move to the other side. <laughs> 